flashback. Oke, menu malam ini petel. <laughs> petel babi ya? <laughs> petel sapi. Prambanan Temple is a complex of 9 century Hindu temple compound in a special region of Yogyakarta in southern Java, Indonesia. Dedicated to the tributary expression of God as a creator, Brahma, the preserver, Vishnu, and the destroyer, Shiva. The temple compound is located approximately 17 kilometers northeast of the city of Yogyakarta on the boundary between Central Java and Yogyakarta province. The temple compound, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is the largest Hindu temple in Indonesia and the second largest in Southeast Asia after Angkor Wat. It is characterized by its tall and pointed architecture, typical of Hindu architecture, and by the towering 47 meter high, central building inside a large complex of individual temples. Brahmanan Temple compound originally consists of 240 temple structures, which represent the grandeur of ancient Java's Hindu art and architecture. And it is also considered as a masterpiece of classical period in Indonesia. Prominent attracts many visitors from around the world. The first building of the temple was complete in the mid of 9th century. It was likely started by Rakai Pikatan and inaugurated by his successor, King Lokapala. Some historians that adhere to Jewel Dynasty theory suggest that the construction of Ramadan probably was meant as the Hindu Sanjaya dynasty and serves to the Buddhist Sailendra dynasties Borobudur and Sewu temple nearby. And was meant to mark the return of Hindu Sanjaya dynasty to power in central Java after almost a century of Buddhist Islander dynasty domination. Nevertheless, the construction of this massive Hindu temple did signify a shift of the Mataram court patronage from Mahayana Buddhism to Savite Hinduism. According to the Sivagra inscription, a public water project to change the course of a river near Sivagra temple was undertaken during the construction of the temple. The river, identified as the Opak River, now runs north to south of the western side of the Prambanan temple compound. Historians suggest that originally the river was curved in further to east and was deemed too near to the main temple. So after being used and expanded for about 80 years, the temples were mysteriously abandoned near the half of the 10th century. In the 930s, the Javanese court was shifted to East Java by Ampu Sendok, who established the Isiana dynasty.
It was not clear, however, the true reason behind the abandonment of central Java realm by this Japanese Mataran Kingdom. A devastating eruption of Mount Merapi volcano located around 25 kilometers north of Rambanan in central Java, or a power struggle, struggle probably caused the shift that even marked the beginning of the decline of the temple as it was soon abandoned and began to deteriorate. In the 1733, Cornelis Antoine Lons, a VOC employee, provided the first report on Prambanan Temple in this journal. Lons was escorting Julius Frederick Coyet, a VOC commissioner of Northwest Java Coast, to Kartasura, then the capital of Mataram, a powerful local Japanese kingdom. During his sojourn in central java he had the opportunity to visit the ruin of ramanan temple which he described as brahmin temple that resembled a mountain of stone So the fact about Prambanan, Prambanan temple is not the original name of the largest Hindu temple complex in Indonesia. This temple has been original name Siwagra. The word Siwagra is taken from Sanskrit which means the house of the Siva. This is because the ancient time, the figure of the god Siva was very special. Even though this temple is dedicated to honoring the Trimurti, God Brahma, God Vishnu, and God Shiva, many believe that this temple was actually built as the building of worship and respect God of Shiva. This can be seen from the 3 meters high statue of Shiva Mahadeva in the main room of Ramadan temple. In fact, the Siva temple, which has 47 meter high, is the main temple and the largest temple in the Prambanan temple complex. So there was another funny story when I was exploring the Prambanan temple and then suddenly there are some kids, there were some kids approached me asking, excuse me, mister, excuse me, mister, picture, I said, no. I'm not a trainer, I'm Indonesian, so if you want to practice English with me, feel free, but I don't think you should take a picture with me because I'm not a trainer. Yeah.